All right, guys, second to last match here on day 15. Thank you for watching the coverage with me. Sekewake Kiribayama, last tournament, last day of a tournament named Sekewake. He'll now be an Ozeki starting in July, taking on Hosho Ryu. Both men are from Mongolia. And uh, Kiribayama is slightly better at 11 and 3 right now. Hosho Ryu at 10 and 4. Kiribayama, of course, winning the entire U show back in March. But he ran into a brick wall named Terano Fuji this tournament. He has a massive losing record against the Yokozuna. I think six or seven matches in a row where he's never beaten Terano Fuji. Um, somebody can, if you know the exact number, you can leave it in the comments. So that is that black dot all the way to the right when he lost yesterday to the Yokozuna. But by then, he pretty much already secured his Ozeki promotion. Um, he certainly put up a spirited fight against Terano Fuji yesterday. And uh, that looks like that could be a fun rivalry for uh, as long as Terano Fuji remains a Yokozuna. Uh, and so, you know, a 12th win here is just sort of the cherry on top for Hoshoru. It probably means a little bit more. Uh, an 11th win here. And, uh, you know, he, he got 10 in March. So that would be 21 going into July. And he would need 12 wins in July if he wants to potentially get promoted to Ozeki. Uh, so yeah, a win here would be a big a big win for him as far as that trajectory is concerned. Uh, okay, other winners and losers. I think I left off at the Miyogiru match. Let me go find it. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, Miyogiru lost to Takanosho. So Miyogiru finishes at 9-6. and six. Takanosho finished 7-8. and eight. Aoyama got a fifth win to finish 5 and 10 over Hokuto Fuji, who finished the 6 and 9. Kinbo's on the, uh, the Achilles heel of my team, uh, not having as good a success up with the big boys this tournament. My guess here 5 finishes 4 and 11, so he'll go way back down the Bonzake. Dai Shoho beat him today, and he finishes 6 and 9. Nishkigi finished with a ninth win to go nine and six by beating Ono Sho, who finishes eight and seven. Sadanumi seven and eight by beating Nishiki Fuji, who uh, uh, is really uh, had a bad boss show, three and twelve record. But at Maigashira three, you know he's completely safe. He'll just go way down the bonds K. Uh, Tobizaru Tomawashi we had on the channel. Takiyasu got a third win to basically finish three and twelve by beating Koto Shoho, the other guy to come back from injury, who finishes basically 2-13. and 13. So both of those men are going to go way down the bonds K. Oho, the Maigashira 16, got an 11th win today. He had a really good tournament, beating Midori Fuji, who finishes 6-9. and nine. Abi, Ura, and everything else has been on the channel. So that's the day slate. Some good matches down in Jurio. I won't give it away, but uh, yeah, go down and watch some of those Jurio matches if you don't normally click on them. Uh, some fun stuff down there uh, to finish off day 15 in the second tier division. There's going to be a lot of movement from Makushita up to Jurio and vice versa, and also between Jurio and uh, Makuchi in the uh, off time between this this boss show and the July boss show. Uh, the July boss show starts on July, what is that, it's in ninth maybe? Uh, the second Sunday in July and goes through until about July 23rd or, or so. Um, so I should be back for that. And uh, I have, like I said, I'm going to have a lot of videos in June. I'm going to have the Tochi Notion interview, an unboxing. I'll have the wrap-up video probably next Saturday or Sunday, uh, June 2 or, no, what's that, June 3 or 4. So look for that, announce the prize winners, etc., etc., Okay, here we go with this one. あ、6対6で全くのゴムなんです。大勝利の険しい表情が印象に残ります。え、あ、時間になりました。立ち合い。立ち合い。立ち合い。立ち合い。立ち合い。立ち合い。立ち合い。立ち合い。立ち合い。
So it is a shame that Kiribayama finished off what was otherwise a very good tournament with two losses on the final two days, but I don't think you can deny him his promotion to Ozeki. I think, uh, you know, the championship, the last tournament, uh, getting more than the 10 wins he needed, getting to 11 this tournament, uh, beating the Ozeki, having a really good match against the Yokozuna, even though he lost. Um, you know, this match, just unfortunate. Uh, I, I think 100% we'll, we'll hear that announcement. They don't announce it today, but they'll probably announce it tomorrow or so. So by the wrap-up video next weekend, I will have full details of his Ozeki promotion. And Hoshoru, like I said, that's a pretty good win for him because now he has 22 between last tournament and this tournament. So if he can... Uh, get another 11 in July, uh, he could find himself being promoted to Ozeki. So big win for him. All right, final match of the tournament, the day, the tournament, everything coming up next, the Ozeki versus the Yokozuna. Come on back.